I'm really happy to tell you about the Whidbey Geodome project. It's finally arrived. The Geodome has landed here on Whidbey Island as of three days ago, and we've been doing trainings to learn how to travel the cosmos in an immersive multimedia environment, this inflatable dome, which is kind of a uh, portable planetarium. And uh, the purpose of this is to develop new forms of education, immersive education, experiential learning uh, processes that engage people in stories about life, about evolution, the story of the universe, the story of the evolution of the solar system, evolution of life on Earth, evolution of humans, and in particular looking at the environmental and ecological issues that we're facing uh, here in the 21st century, uh, how to use that sense of interconnectedness to all life uh, as a motivational vehicle for uh, behavior change and sustainability de development here on the planet. It's uh, a unique opportunity, a small community like ours, uh, to possess this $100,000 dome that uh, has a uh, planetarium software system in it so we can uh, literally use the digital atlas of the universe to uh, demonstrate the Big Bang up to the present moment, 13.7 billion years of evolution. And of course the idea is uh, to use that as an epiphany or an awakening of uh, human consciousness into uh, a more sustainable way of being on the planet. Uh, we are in a position now, we've, we've had the opportunity to uh, go to the Seattle Center starting in April of 2012 to participate in the 50th anniversary celebration of the Seattle World's Fair, the 1962 World's Fair. Uh, this event called The Next 50 uh, is really designed to look at the next 50 years uh, of uh, essentially life here in the Northwest in the Cascadia bioregion and uh, to work toward and, and develop ideas and innovations and solutions for uh, a sustainable world. The geodome uh, has been given a uh, featured site uh, right next to the Space Needle, as a matter of fact, uh, in which uh, we will uh, take thousands of people through an experience that we're calling the Earth Portal, a guided tour of the universe. And with the exhibits that we'll have surrounding the, uh, the geodome itself, we're hoping to initiate people into a conversation, a very uh, generative conversation about solutions for planet Earth. We, uh, we know from the uh, work that's been done with these types of immersive multimedia environments in the past decade that this is a powerful transformative tool and uh, we're looking forward to developing uh, even more powerful uh, modes of experiential learning.